Aloha friends. I'm going to show you how to make butter mayo. I wrote this recipe many, many years ago and it's been a big hit. It is super easy. Okay, so to make the butter mayo, you're going to want a large vessel like this. You could use a mason jar with a wide top. That works perfectly. Um, I don't know where this came from, but I use it all the time. But uh, when I live in Wisconsin, I use a large mouth mason jar. And what you want to use is one egg. And these are so cute. If you haven't seen Vital Farms True Blues, super cute. And the trick is you want a room temperature egg. You do not want it to be cold because it won't work. So plop that on in there. And this recipe, uh, I, met, I wrote a long, long, long time ago, but I was on that carnivore show, uh, Reversed. I was the chef. And I wanted to make deviled eggs for the carnivore show. And I was like, hey, I can do that. Because I usually use bacon fat, but I did not have that. I used butter and everybody went wild for it. So you want one room temperature egg. And I used um, two sticks of the unsalted butter, Vital Farms. And that's heated up, but it's not piping hot because you don't want to cook the egg. But you want it melted, okay? Um, we are going to add pickle juice. I like to add pickle juice. Um, on the carnivore show, I use beef broth. You could use lemon juice, whatever. I just love that pickly flavor. And then mustard. I add a little bit of mustard. On the carnivore version, I skipped the mustard, but um, Kelly Hogan, mustard for you, my friend. And I'm gonna use salt. Sprinkle it with salt. Salt is a flavor enhancer, don't be afraid of that. And I love this stick blender. It was a pricey one, it's a Vitamix one, but oh my gosh, it's so worth the money. It comes apart very easy. Like you don't have to find some weird button. I just love it, it was the best money. Cause I use it a couple times a week. So you're gonna start with it running on low like this. And you're gonna slowly pour the butter in and kind of move it up and down to emulsify it. And don't say this is hollandaise, it's different. <laughs> there we go. And this is better than any store-bought mayo, keto mayo. I don't like the ones with avocado oil, sorry, don't. We have mayo. It's going to get thick in the fridge, really thick, because it will cool, obviously, butter. Um, but that is how simple it is to make. It's so good. I mean, throw that on a sandwich, on a protein bread sandwich, or the next up, we'll do some deviled eggs for you. But delicious. There you have it, butter mayo. And in the next video, I'm going to make deviled eggs with it. And if you love this recipe idea, share it with your friends. Thank you, everybody. If you want to change your life, like I've changed mine with food, I would be honored to help you. Many of you don't know that I was twice my size. I had acid reflux. I had PCOS, which is polycystic ovarian syndrome. I had depression. I had IBS, which is irritable bowel syndrome. And food changed my life. And not only did that happen, I get to eat good food, right? Good food. So if you want to eat good food, have perfected meal plans made by me and personal help with supplements or modifications, if you have Hashimoto's, if you have uh, Graves, if you have IBS, if you have PCOS, contact me. I would be honored to help you. Um, you can go to keto-adapted.com and find a lot of different options there for personalized help. Or message me uh, by commenting below on this YouTube video. Or you can check me out at mariamindbodyhealth.com. Mahalo.